I'm so happy to be talking to you guys again. This is kind of like my first video in the new house because I've been busy with moving. So that's why it's been a little minute, maybe about like a week, a week and a half. I'm not sure, but I am going to be filming some separate videos on my room makeover because I guess like my room isn't a mess right now, but there's just boxes everywhere. This morning, I, well, not this morning, but later on in the evening, I have a hair appointment. I guess you can call it a house call. So she's gonna come here and she's gonna do my hair. And I just need to wash and blow dry my hair and take it out. But in the meantime, I'm gonna fix me some breakfast before I do that. And I just wanted to show y'all what I'm gonna be having this morning. Okay, so I prepared some potato hash browns and just season them a little bit. The toast cooking in here that I'm gonna have with the potatoes. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and prepare me a quick little smoothie let me show y'all what i'm let me just show y'all let me show y'all what i'm gonna put in my smoothie i'm just gonna make me a quick smoothie i've been making this for the last few days and it's actually been pretty good um so yeah let me go ahead and show y'all what i like to put in my smoothies i don't know i'm a smoothie girl now i've been deciding to put this little ninja bullet we got in there to use nobody uses it so i was like let me just start making some smoothies okay so usually this is what I like to use in my smoothie, this mixed fruit um, little frozen bag mix. And then usually I would put some banana in here, but we just ran out. So <clears throat> I guess I'm just gonna have to do without it today. And then I like to add in this vanilla coconut milk yogurt. It's actually pretty good. to just focus on that because I was scared that she was gonna get here and then I would still be on my hair so I was just focusing on my hair taking it out washing and blow drying it and this is my hair fully blow dried out as you can tell I think I need like a trim for three honestly um I feel like every time I take my hair out and blow dry I just had more and more hair honestly I just put on me a little one two cute little two-piece set then just chill and wait for her to get here i'm kind of hungry i'm gonna have me a little snack but yeah i'm gonna talk to y'all probably when she gets here I gotta work for the both of us. put you in the driver's seat i got a very intimate in my love when you ride with me So I decided to just um, go to sleep. So after that, I just went to bed. And I have a 9, 9.15, 9 Pilates class I'm going to today. I've been wanting to try Pilates for a while. So I'm about to start getting ready and getting dressed for Pilates. I'm going to see y'all when I am getting dressed. I'm just about to brush my teeth, wash my face, go ahead and get in the shower. Y'all already know the drill. Okay, y'all, I am out the shower. And let me just show y'all my new hair. I love it. The only downside is it just took so long. Would I ever get this hairstyle again? Yeah, but probably like not for a while. I took my own edges out. She said I could take my own edges out. So that's what I did. But I don't think I'm going to lay them down because I assume I'm probably going to end up sweating in Pilates. So I don't want to do my edges just for them to sweat out. And then it gets all over my face. And then I could break out. That's just too much. Yeah, I just wanted to show you what I'm wearing to Pilates today. 
don't mind my bed in the back y'all know my bed is on the floor right now because my bed frame isn't here but this is what i'm wearing something super cute super simple it's a two-piece set this part isn't a part of it i just wanted to wear a nice sports bra just in case i get too hot and wanted to take this off because I wish it had holes because I don't like how baggy the arms are. and for my first time it was really really good overall my pilates experience was a 10 out of 10 um there were a few young, other younger women in there with me but the rest was just like older white women i actually love pilates i didn't get as much content as i wanted to because my phone ended up dying um i really i swear to god i thought i charged it this morning but i guess i just didn't or charged it last night but i didn't Hey y'all, I am back. It is the next day and it's later in the day. It's like 8.30, not 8.30, like 8 o'clock. And like I said, I've been craving crumble cookies and this week's looks really good. And I really wanna try them. So we're gonna head there now. Cause y'all are gonna see me drive and I need to concentrate. So uh, I'ma just see y'all when I pull up to crumble cookie. Cause I don't want y'all distra distracting me while I'm driving. Gee. I'm trying to figure out where I can put y'all. Hold on, I can't even see you. Let me adjust my seat first. Let me put my crock in sports mode too, because I don't know. Something about driving with a loose crock that really just, just, I don't know. It just does something to my nerves. Okay, y'all. So I'm walking up to the crumble cookies, and it's giving like it's a long ass line in here. It's a little hot out here, and hold on, let me just show you. Okay, I got my cookies. I'm so sad I, never, I was not able to get the ones that I really wanted, but it's okay. Um, we could probably try next week if it's good, but if it's not, oh well. Okay, y'all, I'm back and I have my cookies. I got two singles because they were sold out of the other ones that I wanted. Try the strawberry crumb cake first. Can't really taste like too much of the strawberry, but it's good. 7 out of 10 because I can't taste the strawberries. Try the sea salt and hazelnut. Oh. And the Nutella filling is really sticking to the back of my teeth. And I don't like that. That was my crumble cookie review. I'm going to head off and start getting ready for bed. And then I'm going to see y'all later. Hey y'all, I am back. It's Wednesday. So right now I am about to head over to Ulta. I don't know which one I want to go to. If I want to go to the one at the mall or do I want to go to the one um, in the town center. Yeah, so I need to go to Ulta to get some stuff for Lucky Girl Studios. If you don't know, now you know. That is my MBA business, my brand. I launched my MBA page. 
about a day or two ago so i just need to get some more products so i can officially start taking models and start practicing on people's faces because i practice on myself but i just need to get some experience with other skin textures and skin colors because i definitely need to know how to do darker skin colors as well as lighter skin colors anyway let me show you how to do it so this is what I have on this blue bodysuit from Target. And then my green foam dunks. I'm not sure if that's what you call them, but that's what I'm gonna call them. Let me see if I can set y'all up so I can like give y'all a real OOTD. I'm sorry, but it's gonna get way better when I get my room and stuff set up. I just ordered my bed frame. So this is the Fit to Body's Tea. I didn't feel like switching out my purse, so I don't know. I feel like just throw the outfit off, but that's okay because mind your business. And the thong, the thong imprint is bothering me. Like it's really bothering me, but it's okay. I'm still cute though. I just wanted to take this opportunity to practice on my eyebrows. I don't know if they're too dark or maybe I just need a full face. Okay. I'm gonna check on y'all when I head into Ulta. Okay, y'all, I am at Ulta. And I've never been to this one before. This is, this one is pretty big. It's my first time being here. Okay, the first thing I'm looking for is, what is this? Okay, I do need a good brush set. Flawless face. I don't know which one of these I need to get, but first I need to get, where are, oh, let me see. Okay, I'm looking for the Maybelline foundation. I'm not sure which one of these I need to get first though. Where is the... Okay, hold on. Let me go find it and then I'm gonna come back to y'all. Okay, so Milani and NYX are both having a sale right now. I think the NYX is buy two get three, buy two get one free. And then Milani is having a, I don't know, which, I don't know what sale they're having, but they're having a sale and you get some Milani products. So I think I'm gonna pick up the Milani and make it last. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put that in the cart. Okay, they have the, I think I need to pick up a couple of these. They do have these as well too, but I haven't been hearing that much about these, so I think I'm going to leave that alone this time. I'm going to grab 10 neutral. <clears throat> Let me compare these two. Okay. Okay, so I grabbed some more things off of camera and now I'm just in the foundation section. This whole section was in my face this whole entire time and I didn't see it. So I need to grab some stuff for the darker skin tones and I'm trying to figure out which one of these is my skin tone because I'm going to be able to practice my makeup on me too. So I grabbed truffle for myself because I think that's just about right and I think these are a little too warm for me but latte does kind of look similar to my color as well I picked up um here is truffle and a latte honestly I think I might go with truffle it is a little bit warmer but I have noticed that I am a little bit on the neutral side, so I think I'm going to pick up truffle. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna get truffle, and then I need to get Java for the darker skin tones. And then I need to go ahead and I need to grab some of their finishing powders, the pressed powders, and then I need to grab a loose finishing powder. So natural buff hey y'all i am back and i just well it's been a few hours since i got back from ulta and the reason for that is i had some content to film and then i also what else i made myself some lunch i was very tired and very hungry 
I'm the type of person that will forget to eat food if they get too busy. So I'm gonna show y'all a quick rundown of everything I got from Ulta to build my MBA kit so far. So first I'm just gonna start with the brushes cause that's what's sticking out of the bag. I got the Flawless Face Brush Set 6 Piece Collection Blending Brush and then I got a extra plus blush brush for the makeup sponges. I just got a four pack of the Ulta Beauty Teardrop Makeup Sponges Foundations. I got four Maybelline Fit Me Foundations. I'm going to start with the lighter complexions first. I got the 332 Golden Caramel and then I got the Classic Tan 335. I got the 362 and the 375. 362 is truffle, 375 is java, java, however you say it. Um, and I think I need to get another one in between. Them. I got three e.l.f. concealers. I got the shade medium warm, deep caramel, and tan neutral. I got a cream contour palette from e.l.f. Something simple to start out with. And then I got the Fit Me Matte and Poreless uh, Pressed Powder in the shade 230 Natural Buff. Power Good Primer. I got the pink one with the 4% um, niacinamide. I heard this was acne safe, safe, so I wanted to go ahead and try this out. A Make It Last Original from the Milani brand, the Natural Finish Setting Spray. I've been hearing so many good things about this. Uh, just a pencil sharpener for my liners. A perfect precision eyeliner in the shade black from LA Girl. I got a NYX lip pencil, NYX lip pencil in the shade Espresso. A called Micro Brow Pencil in the shade Espresso as well. I got Lash Princess. This is pretty affordable too. I've been hearing good things about this. Camo Cream Blush, liquid blush in the shade Pinky Promise. This is super cute. I've never tried a pink blush before, so I'm excited. A soft matte lip cream from NYX in the shade Cane. And I got a shade in the Butter Gloss in the Creme Brulee. That's it for all of my products for my MUA kit. I will definitely be getting some more stuff later on as I continue to practice my craft. Okay, so yeah, I just wanted to show y'all what I was getting from Ulta to build my makeup kit and then start my business. I'm so excited. I'm not gonna lie y'all, June has been such a good month for me and I feel so blessed, like so blessed. And I have so much gratitude towards the blessings that have been coming to me this month. I'ma just put that out there now so it don't get taken away from me. I just feel so good about the things that are coming up in my life. And it's just only up from here. Like I'm so excited about this content and I'm so excited to start my business. If only y'all would start booking these model sets because every time I post something about getting model sets, it's like y'all don't want to get y'all makeup done for free. Hello, but yeah, I am back. I forgot to tell y'all that I want to go get my nails done. I had myself a nail appointment and I just got um one of my packages delivered. I ordered a couple things from Shein and I just want to go ahead and show y'all what I got. First things first, I got a t-shirt. I'm literally just a girl. I feel like that's so fitting and it's so cute. I think I got a two piece set. Is this it? I think this might be it. Let me see. Okay, it is. Super cute. Strap holter top. And then I got a purse. Super cute top. I think it kind of might be like a sweater. Oh no, it's not. Okay, good. I thought it was gonna be more of like a sweater, but this is just so cute. Oh. So on the site, this looks more white, but in person, it's giving like cream, almost yellow. It's still cute, but I was expecting it to be more of a white color, but this looks like yellow. And it looks kind of see-through. Okay, these are the shorts. They're super cute. I'm kind of worried about the back and how the back is going to look on me. But the front is cute. Very fitting. It's giving manifestation. Featured a millionaire. The skirt is so cute, but it looks so tiny. I don't think it's going to cover anything. I don't know. I think my butt might be showing if I wear this. I might have to wear some shorts under this skirt. I have an outfit planned. That's why I got this skirt and I didn't get it with like another shirt to match it because I already have a separate shirt coming in the mail for that. 
I got some bows as well. These are super cute. So now I can finally indulge in the bow trend because like I said, it's not over until I do my little bow thing. Hey y'all, I am back and it is the next morning. It is Saturday morning. And like I said, I have a family photo shoot today. So I'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready for that. I'm going to do my edges and um, put some mousse on my hair and then start doing my makeup. We're gonna leave around 1.30, but I'm trying to give myself enough time to do everything I need to do. Hey y'all, I am back and at this point my makeup is done and I have my dress on. I'm just trying to put my earrings in because every time I want to put some earrings in, I always end up like rushing and then I just throw them in my bag and then I'll say I'll put them on before we get there or on the car ride over and then they just never end up in my ear. So I'm going to put them on now before I forget to put them on later. The blend is just giving. I'm trying to figure out if I want to do matte or if I want to do gloss. I feel like gloss is just gonna complete the look. And then I need to find my scent of the day. Hold on, I know exactly which one I'm gonna wear. I need to find it. I'm gonna pair it with a nice perfume oil. Okay, I think that's good enough. Given matte lip, y'all. Like, I don't know. I need to decide. Like, I'm gonna call Bria. Just like, come on, y'all. Is it giving flip over? Because these is flip over. Oh. oh, it's giving flip over. This flip over eats. Hold on. I haven't worn my braids like this yet, and this is getting cute, getting sexy. Okay, y'all, this is me ending off this vlog, but as y'all can see, I'm in my new bed now. Ew. My bed frame came in the mail a few days ago, and we just put it up today. It's so cute, and it matches, um, it matches the color of my vanity, so this is velvet and black, and then my vanity is black. It's just so cute. Like, if it's my aesthetic, it's giving sophisticated grown hotel rich auntie um and then with my silk pillowcases i kind of want to get some new silk pillowcases and then i need to get some new pillows because these are just old deflated and used so i'm gonna probably go to target and get me some but uh, let me stop talking too much and just end this video off i just wanted to show y'all my new bed frame it's so cute and i'm probably do some more video i'm probably do some more decorating and things in the next video so thank you guys so much for watching can't wait to see you in the next vlog bye